Today is December 30th. It's our anniversary. I got this cute um, long sleeve knitted dress on. It's super cute. My necklace, earrings, and yeah, y'all. Um, so it's our anniversary. We just had some amazing sushi. I feel like we've been having sushi every single day. I spoke a little German. If you guys didn't see the clip, it's on my Instagram. But basically, I was like, Ich kann nicht glauben, dass wir seit acht Jahren zusammen sind. Which means, I can't believe we've been together for eight years. And then I said Prost, which means cheers in German. So yeah. I have this on my face. It's a cloud. It's really cute. I haven't seen these before. In my last vlog, I showed you guys how I was talking about it, right? So I got some shipped because Target, because my Target didn't have them and yeah they're on my face you can leave these on overnight which i love and the sad thing is i wanted to do my makeup today and look very well put together elegant giving you elegant right but tell me why i ran out of concealer my favorite concealer is the Too faced born this way concealer and i ran out i hate that because how am I supposed to do my makeup? I either do fully natural, no lashes, no nothing, like this, or I go full out with a full face, a full beat. And I can't get no full beat if I don't have a concealer. Like, that's just not going to work. But yeah. And then I got my little hair pieces out. I feel like I always got to have my hair pieces out, but yeah y'all i'm looking so cute today just got full off of a lot of sushi i had a salmon skin roll a shrimp tempura roll which is my favorite and i tried bryant spicy crab roll and then there was a spider crab roll which was a a tempura fried soft shell crab which was pretty good but I was telling Brian like <laughs> nothing compares to the shrimp tempura roll anybody that likes sushi do y'all like raw sushi or cooked rolls I like cooked rolls I don't like raw sushi maybe that's just me I don't know and the uh, the new year's is about to come up I'm making sure I'm washing all of these clothes because that's something that my family's been doing to bring into the new year I made lima beans that's something my grandmother used to do Who are you gypsy gypsy <laughs> we just got a package guys bye an espresso sorry my voice is a little hoarse if y'all can hear that in the background that's call of duty so look at this wow so we got two things of the roasted hazelnuts if it will focus two things of the roasted hazelnut I love me some Nespresso coffee and lately the Starbucks brand pods have not been put in as much as these. These roasted hazelnut, I don't know if it's limited edition or not, but these are so freaking good. It tastes like a Nutella coffee. So good. Then, then we have the double espresso Chiaro. So I like this because comes with two espresso shots instead of making two at a single time if that makes sense I don't know and these are the ones Bryant wanted these are the Kahawa Yakongo some type of African coffee and he likes a bold flavor coffee and I like the printing it's really cute and he got two and then lastly <clears throat> and then this is a carafe pour over style mug which I don't know if this is a sample or what but yeah I never had this but I can't wait to have my hazelnuts
We need one more. Whoa. That's insane. That is insane. So, my nails are literally bare. And I want to put some new nails on. So, in here we have one of my nails one of my nail sets from last year because it's 2024 baby but yeah these are so pretty i mean come on but i'm thinking of putting on these nails like they're just giving royalty i love these type of nails i had one pair before if y'all watched my um I think it was my first vlog. But my first vlog I had like a royalty pair. This is another royalty pair. But it's nude. I can't wait to put these on. I think I want to put these on. I don't know. So it's either going to be the old pair or the new pair. I think I'm going to put on the new pair. Okay y'all. So we got a minimal grocery haul. So first we have a whole bunch of rice over here. His bright loves his rice. Then we got some tomato bisque because I'm not feeling that good. And yeah, we got tomato bisque for me. We got some raspberries. Two things of raspberries. I always have my Nutella and Go, but I wanted to have the pretzels with it this time. Uh -huh. Then we got some bananas. Some soft bristle toothbrushes for me. We got some brioche bread. Have to have that. A whole bunch of palm drinks and two kombuchas. Wanted to try this um, oat milk creamer. This is the brown sugar flavor. I never had it. They need to come out with some more oat milk creamers, coffee creamers. Some Luigi strawberry and lemon rice. Some chicken breasts, I mean, not chicken breasts, chicken patties, and turkey burgers. And I think that's everything. Real simple, real minimalistic. We just got some stuff from Target. Let's see what's in here. First, we got some cheddar jalapeno. Uh, Cheetos brand really loves these. I got a wet brush, a detangler wet brush. Hopefully this does justice for my hair. Now that I'm looking at it, I don't think this is the kind I wanted. But we'll see. We'll see. I don't know if this is for girls with like natural African American hair. Uh, I had to re-up on my favorites. This is my all-time favorite leave-in conditioner it has no chemicals paraben parabens none of that it's so great i love this stuff plus it smells amazing i just always have to have this i needed some more dark brown sugar i always get the dark not the light another thing of eco styler gel I had boba before, but it's from Target, and it's the mango flavor. I also want to try the strawberry and lemonade, but yeah, I'm going to try this out. It's this is the package I was waiting on. This stuff has a great coverage. I don't use high-end foundation all the time, but I definitely use high-end concealer when I do my makeup. And this is my favorite high-end concealer. This is the Born This Way by Too Faced um, Multi-Use Concealer. Super coverage. These two combinations are my holy grail. I am so happy that I re-up because I can't go without these two. My holy freaking grail my holy grail this is a freaking primer a setting spray and a refreshing spray in one bottle how cool is that i've been using this since forever this is my holy grail you better believe this is my holy grail <laughs>
just did his eyebrows and I added a touch, like a little cut. And he wants the other side done now. Because she is magnificent at what she does. And she is <laughs> truly, truly gifted. So. Cannot let talent like this get past you. So I just used the spoolie. This is a makeup spoolie for your eyebrows. And then a razor. And then some eyebrow scissors that's in here. And yeah, let's do the other side. Uh-oh. Don't fight over the box. Second coffee of the day. First, we're going to take my brown sugar. I can't have a coffee without brown sugar. So, two scoops. This is a teaspoon size, so this is one tablespoon. Coffee pot of the day. It's going to be another hazelnut because I love roasted hazelnut, y'all. It's one of my favorite coffees that, ooh, to some people, second coffee of the day would seem crazy, but to me, it's very normal. This is going to be an iced coffee. I haven't had hot coffee in so long, y'all. We got our coffee cup. First, we're going to shake our oat milk so that we don't get any separation because separation is normal when you have natural milks and stuff like that. Non processed milks, I guess. I'm just going to put like one fourth cup of that. Best coffee ever. Now I'm gonna put my ice. Tarani. One, two, three. Don't need too much. Sometimes I could get hectic with the caramel. And then, luckily, I know it's January, but we still got our gingerbread. I don't even think gingerbread should just be for December. I think it should be for all year round. But apparently, the coffee creamer marketers. They don't think so. They don't think so. And I'm just gonna add like four splashes of that. And mix it. Sometimes I like to remove a little bit of the ice. Mm, she ready. She ready! That lid on tight. Anyways, I love this cup. I don't know what the Stanley cups are getting all the hype about, but whoever making the Stanley cups, y'all making good money off of some cups. Honestly, y'all making, y'all, y'all. Huh? Show the people. See that? <laughs> That's work, artwork, right <laughs> We got pomegranate juice. So right now, oh wait, look at my nails, guys. Super pretty. Right now, we are going to be 
having a little drinky drink. I told him to get some pomegranate. Orange blossom white tea. Yeah. Or pomegranate lemonade. So this is Tito's mixed with pomegranate yes. lemonade. Strong too much. The game outside on the deck. He loves sitting on the couch with me, y'all. <laughs> Hello. Welcome to Hootie Burger. Okay. But yeah, right now we're playing the Wii. Again. But this time we're playing... Eight. Mario Party Eight. Eight. I love my hair. It's super, love super cute. Yes, I, love I love it. I just love it. The curls are given what they're supposed to give. Um, we're just having a grand all the time. I don't know if y'all can hear me because this music is so loud in the background, but mm -hmm. well, yeah. I recommend everybody get a wee. Okay, say cheese. What? <laughs> I let them into the room and this is what happens. Be good now. Yeah, I have so many like videos that I need to do that I haven't done. Me and Brian sitting down and I'm putting him in the hot seat and asking him hot seat questions. And then the other one is asking him questions that girls are too afraid to ask and then the most important one that I want to make is why I don't have friends and I don't fit in and that topic has Twenty-two pages on why I don't have friends. That one's gonna be really juicy, really detailed. And then I was just manifesting, writing down some manifestations that I really want to focus on um, when it comes to my YouTube channel because I have so many creative ideas up my sleeve. I'm such a creative person, and I want to have my voice out there because TikTok platform a long time ago with 150,000 and it got deleted last year on my birthday. Anyways, that's another story, but yeah, I want to have my voice out there because I know I have a lot of stuff to say that could help people, right? But yeah, I really want to get these videos out the way because I just can't wait and I know that is stuff that needs to be said and I know it's creative, fun, entertaining, so on. But tell me why the other day I had a toothache, but it's not really like a toothache. Where my dentist took my um, wisdom teeth out at, so it was my gum aching. My face blew up like a freaking puffer fish. So this side of my face was swollen and I wanted to show you guys but I was so uncomfortable with how I was looking and I wasn't feeling great at all. I need to find out what I'm going to do with my hair because it's just dry right now. And I don't know. I have a lot of hair ideas I want to try on Pinterest for my natural hair. But most of them I got to do braids in my hair or cornrows and I got nails in. It's not easy to do that with nails in. So I'm going to get my groceries from ShopRite and Walmart. But I want to try Sam's Club because... They have a lot more options, and of course they have stuff in bulk. But yeah, I think I'm going to get Sam's Club groceries this time. Brian thought it was a pretty good idea. I think it is too. Everything's in bulk. There's definitely more options, meat options, and stuff like that. So yeah. So, a big storm is going on right now. And Brian... Brian, can you explain what you're doing? Hmm? What are you doing? When I was little, my grandmother used to sing when it was storming and thunder. Turn off all the electric. 
Sit in the dark. <laughs> Cover yourself. And wait till it passes. What? And that's what I'm doing. Yeah, but why are you crossing your body and stuff? For protection. You read in the Bible? When they the when the storm came to the doors of the millions and millions. You never know. Storm All right, you're acting like Uncle Floyd. Huh? You're acting like Uncle Floyd. Alright. I'm just telling you what the what the history say. Okay. And if you don't know if you don't do it, then you don't need to be up moving around or nothing in the storm. That's how we're going to get So we just got some stuff from Sam's Club. They delivered it in this big Reese's box, which is kind of crazy. But I got to hurry up because my camera is about to die. So first we got this big old cob salad for Bri. We got some Nutella and Go, big pack of those. We got a rotisserie chicken, big pack of those. My temporal, I don't know if this has mayo on it. I thought it wasn't going to have any, but hopefully that's not mayo. I hate freaking mayo. And then lastly, we got some raspberries. And that's it for right now. Tomorrow we're going to do more grocery shopping. So first, we got some waters. A 40 pack of waters. Big thing of sparkling waters. Variety pack, lemon, lime, and... Pample mousse for Bri. Please excuse my nails. We got a big thing of paper towels for soft. A big thing of cherries. I heard something about this and I wanted to try it out because this could go with a lot of dishes or whatever. I wanted to see how this tastes. This could go with pasta, pretty much anything. And it's grilled and seasoned. Italian style herb grilled chicken breast. We got a whole thing of eggs. This comes with 24 eggs. I didn't know Sam's Club had these, which are um, Chick fil A copycats. I don't know if, I don't know where I saw this from, but bread or design of bread, whatever. And then we got some things of chicken fried rice from Sam's Club. Now for Target. Let's see, I got two things of blind espresso because we ran out and I can't go without my two shots of blind espresso. Okay, so that's that. I haven't had this in a while. This is the raw sugar watermelon and fresh mint. This smells like a Jolly Rancher. It smells so good. Plus, I don't think this has any parabens. Yeah, it doesn't have sulfates, parabens, or phthalates, but I know it didn't have any parabens, which is super good. So that's that. We had the bobas, the poppin' bobas the other day, and we're going to be trying this kind, which is the strawberry lemonade and green tea. We already had the mango kind, and then we're also going to be trying the popping boba blueberry pomegranate black tea. So we already had the mango. I like these. Bryant likes them as well. And yeah, we're going to be trying these out as well. So can't wait for that. I also needed to re-up on my favorite bath and body oil. You could use this when you're just getting out of the shower. Or you could just use this to apply your daily moisture. But I love this scent. This is the scent Eucalyptus by Dr. Teal's. I had to have some more of this, so I got some. And lastly, I got this game because I heard it opens your subconscious mind with your partner. And it gets you to think deeper on stuff. And I love, I love deep topics. So this is called the Hella Awkward Game. And I wanted to try it out. So that's what me and Brian are going to be trying out soon. We have a lot of other couples games, but this is going to be added to our collection. And that's everything, y'all. I'm still waiting on ShopRite, and then that's about it. And all I got from ShopRite is two caramels. I got the Giotelli and the Tarani. 
two red onions, a couple, a few tomatoes, salami, cooper cheese, and uh, some stone fire naan. And this is the roasted garlic. I plan to just do a non Italian sandwich. I wanted to get on here and show y'all how I did my hair. I just did little pieces pull back. I don't know what the style's called. In the morning, I'll show you guys how I do my hair when it's not dried up. Like how it looks when it's not dried up. But this would be the finishing result. We just had some pizza from Pizza Hut. And tell me why Bryant was holding my hair back. Because I threw up. I threw up the whole pizza like I saw it I felt it coming I ran to the bathroom I just threw up but I'm feeling better now I'm drinking some water and yeah I just got done cleaning the sink because that was the furthest spot I could run to um and this is Comet because I was cleaning the sink with Comet and Fabuloso but yeah Y'all, tell me why we just had to get new blinds because the cat, oh, excuse my nail, because the cats ruined our blinds. So luckily, Brian um, measured the blinds and we got the right size and everything, but I don't know if y'all saw the clip earlier and y'all saw that the blinds were messed up, but this is a fresh batch of new blinds. I'm so excited. I mean, not excited. I'm so relieved because that's unacceptable. I don't have to worry about nobody looking at me or Bri when we're naked. And yeah, thanks to the cats, we had to get new blinds, but we got the new blinds. My man's a builder, okay? So I'm going to be showing y'all how I do my hair. So I do the little... Spin, 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 if I had some braids on, that would be nice, I don't feel like sitting down for hours, getting my hair done. Oh, Although, getting my hair done do be nice with the hair lady I go to because I don't let everybody touch my hair, number one. It does be nice because she likes to put on a movie and chat it up. And conversations are always healthy conversations with the other classes. Um, and yeah, that's nice because I'm down for all those hours. It's like the most pleasant experience. <laughs> it's like the most everywhere I'm going to be. And then I'm going in with my curls. And I'm going in with my curls. This stuff smells so good. Shake it so I get to the bottom. I'm using a lot. More than that. More than that. It smells so good. Walking and sliding and stepping and spinning and standing on bitches and standing on men. Walk, 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 walk. Walking on beats, got the yo on my feet. Just venture my freak so he hold on my meat. Spin you with me since you rep me. I tend to stop when I can. Put my hair in the ponytail like this. Spin, spin, spin. That's how it looks. Spin, spin. Then. I'm gonna go in with my wet brush that I originally recently purchased from Target. My edges are out for later. Same to the other side, of course. Hands are sleeping, so what I do is I take a paper towel and I wrap it around the brush so that I could get a good grip. So that's that. <sighs> then we're gonna take our gel. I'm using the Eco Styler olive oil and take a slab of it. Kind of mix it into my hands. Just start at the root of my hair and then work our way down. And then a long, long time ago on YouTube, when I started 
taking care of my natural hair I heard of the prayer hands which is just this you just break it like that so I like to do that technique a lot so you get that now we're gonna brush it again and get in the back the back is the hardest I don't know why this thingamabob and I'm going to do my edges that are left out but this brush is legit it's legit but this is the end result it's air dry and then I'm gonna put the buns in this might be the end of the video if it is thank you guys for watching make sure you like comment and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one